Welcome to Near Reality. The biggest server out there, peaking at well over 2,000 players online. And with the return, this game is doing amazing. Link down below if you do want to hop on. And as well today, I've got a crazy giveaway. One lucky winner is going to walk away with a free $25 donator pin. As well, if we manage to hit 150 likes on today's video, I'm going to add a bonus Lime Whip to today's giveaway. One of the most sought after items on this game, so of course show the love. Either way, if you want an entry on today's giveaway, make sure to like the video, comment your new reality IGN down below, and of course subscribe to the channel. Of course, hope to see you online, and I really hope you enjoyed today's video. So, today we've got something a little bit different than what we're used to. A fan requested video, but we're going to be running through both tiers of Near Reality's mystery boxes. We have equal amounts of regular and ultra mystery boxes to run through to compare the loot and see which give the most bang for your buck. As well, I'm not going to lie, there's no actual information on what either of the boxes give publicly available, so this is going to be just as big of a shock as it is to you, to me. Either way, in total we have 750 of the regulars and 250 of the ultras, being worth 3750 a stack. In total, we're going to be opening up $7,500 worth of mystery boxes today. Be sure to stay tuned, and of course, right over to the beta. I am going to try and keep today's video as short as possible, but nothing on an account but 750 and 250. I'm not going to lie, this is actually very intriguing to me. Like I said, there is no actual info on what any of these boxes give. You can sort of spin to win and have a little bit of a glance. But as well, as you see, when you're opening up the boxes, you not only get your guaranteed rare reward, but you'll also get two extra rolls for a ton of goodies. So again, this is going to take a minute. Either way, we get to clicking. Okay, yeah, these are going to have some insane loot on them. God damn. This is what I mean, dude. Literally 150 in. Regular M boxes are still actually insane. Quick little skim in the bank, you got a ton. A couple rares, the helm, the plate, bunny ears, imbued heart, couple pet M boxes, but god damn. Yeah, I need a stack of these on the iron ASAP, holy moly. Either way, gonna spam through the remaining 600 and catch you in a minute. Oh my fucking god. Now that's like probably one of the rarest things you can pull. Holy shit, I just got a black party hat. Uh, okay, well, fair enough. Okay, c continuing on. And the last 14. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, these are actually insane. I've opened up a couple, don't get me wrong, on the main, but never to this amount, but holy shit. Last two? Holy shit! Okay, okay I did not expect that. We got a Christmas cracker on the last one. Okay, okay. <laughs> Quick little skim through the bank. 
Oh, bear in mind too, D Defender and Torso and Fire Cape are three items that you'll only get one of. So before you actually open up M boxes, I recommend getting those so you don't actually pull it. Either way, no complaints, but quick little skim through. These are mental. Yeah, these are actually insane. I can't wait for the Ultras, man. Holy moly. Let me quick organize and give me a minute here. So starting off your skilling slash secondaries roll tab. I'm not gonna lie, this alone is insane. Looking at everything, especially maining Iron Man, is actually insane on all this. Like 22,000 Diamond Bolt E, there is a ton on secondaries. I'm not gonna lie, the actual secondary rolls save a lot. Even if you get a trash loot, your secondary loot, 9 times out of 10, will pull you a ton of money too. Your common slash rare tab, the majority of it, is Barrows, Infinity, Deep Boots, DX, Amia Furies, stuff like that, but overall not too bad. And the biggins, why we're mainly thinking, yeah, dude, these are actually insane. I can't wait for the Ultras, man. Christmas Cracker, Easter Eggs, Ami Eternal Glory, Disco Returning, 4 DFS, 2 Ancient Wyverns, couple Black Tourmaline Cores, 3 Black Party Hats, brother. Overall though, they're actually really, really good. For Imbues, you can't complain on a $5 box by any means. And remember, every three regular mystery boxes you open is only worth one of the higher tier. I'm curious while we're here, five pet boxes. Monkey, Spirit Caliphate, Gecko, Labrador, Monkey. Three black fats, so is insane. Those are 4k forge points each. That's 12k. Imagine, open up a $5 box and get a black brother. Overall though, I am honestly pretty impressed with the regulars. Either way, on to 250 ultimate mystery boxes. Give me a minute. And again, on to a complete freshie. I'm not gonna lie, these are the ones that I am more excited for. The ultra or ultimate, whatever you guys want to call them. These look insane. Like, ah, there are actually so much more you can get from these. Oh, I didn't know the orange party hat. Okay. So just by spinning through a couple, you can see rewards are completely different. Oh, ah. Uh. I mean, still, I'll take that. Same thing with the other ones, though. You do get two secondary drops alongside your box. This is, uh, this is gonna be interesting to actually compare, though. I will say, bring us, what the fuck is that? And bear in mind, too, you can actually pull the lime from these, too. Okay. 3k cannibals? I'm pretty sure, correct me if I'm wrong, but I am pretty sure your secondary rolls, too, are hugely increased. Either way, same thing as last, we spam click and wish us luck. Bro, that's not even a rare, what do you mean? Bro! Okay, this is gonna be interesting. 2.38 to go, wish us luck. And the last 10, immediately, holy fuck, ultimates are insane. Come on, something else? What the fuck? Yeah, holy shit, ultimates are crazy good. Like, remnant points alone? Holy moly. Rares, huge upgrades, god damn. Same thing, let me organize and give me a minute. Okay, yep, secondaries are definitely increased. 70,000 cannibals, 100k scales. Now remember, this is off a third of the amount. Holy moly. But again, a quick skim through, you are going to be drooling. I'm going to say it right now, if you're going to buy yourself some boxes, buy the ultimates. These are mental. Third age pieces out the ass, which are crazy remnant points. Massive upgrades, 4D warhammers, 5 blowpipes, prims, eternals, hearts, pagasian, like everything you could ask for. And rares too are completely different. Yeah, drop table wise for these are way better. What the fuck? These are good. Okay, in my opinion, ultimates are way better. But again, you do get three times the amount if you're going for regulars, or you get access to a different drop table for way more goodies. Make your choice, but you know my personal favorite, holy shit. Anyways, like I said, super quick video today. Wanted to do a quick rundown of either the regular and the ultimate mystery boxes on Near Reality. 
Remember though, link down below if you do want to pop onto this server, this is easily the biggest server out, peaking at well over 1500 players online still. Hope to see you online. As well, let me know your thoughts down below on which box you personally prefer. I'm gonna be sticking with the ultimates from now on, but goddamn. Either way, don't forget to enter for that massive giveaway, and of course to join mine in the Near Reality Discords by using links down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and later.